there's a lot of, I feel like, inventions that were done by Latinos. Ooh. Like the beauty blender. I know, yes! I I, no, I always but forget I'm, that. <laughs> the Latina invented it. Important things that were invented by Latinos. Seven groundbreaking inventions by Latino innovators. It's from history.com. Thank you, history.com. Color TV. Really? You want to see things in Technicolor? Call up your local Latino. I'm just kidding. I mean, it makes sense that we were like, we can't look at this black and white anymore. We have to figure this out. So that was invented by Guillermo Gonzalez Camarena. So he was an electrical engineer who specialized in electronics at the National Polytechnic Institute of Mexico. That says prior to his invention, televisions only broadcast images in monochrome. So he was the one that was like, guys, I got it. We don't yeah. have to look at this anymore. Yeah, the patent was filed in 1940. Earthquake sensing technology. Whoa. Because of Seismograph? This was invented by Professor Arturo Arias Suarez from University of Chile and basically served as the director of Chile's Instituto de In Investigación y Ensayos de Materiales, so materials research and testing. So yeah, he developed the instrumental seismic intensity. So every time you're like in California and there's an earthquake and you're Googling how much was that earthquake, think about this Chilean professor. Thank you, Chile. The CAPTCHA! Oh! You know that thing where you're like... Your cybersecurity. Your cybersecurity. Yes. When you're like, are you a robot? Shout out to Guatemala. Guatemala was like, we're not allowing robots to hack you. Yeah, this was as this was invented by Von Odd, a co-founder of Duolingo. Duolingo's Guatemalan? The owl. Shout out to the owl for inventing CAPTCHA. We're just kidding. We knew it. Um, yeah, he created the cybersecurity technology as a PhD student when he was at Carnegie Mellon University. And he also co-founded Duolingo. And he also, yes. Can I tell you my sad Duolingo story real quick? Oh yeah, I'm scared. So, well it's not that sad, <laughs> it's sad for me. I had like a 2000 day streak because I started it in COVID for Spanish. And something, I don't remember exactly what happened, but I lost um, like internet. So I, I lost the streak. And then I actually emailed Duolingo like to like be like, can you put it back? And they were like, yes, we can put it back because it's a one-time thing. So they were like, sure. But then my account kicked me out. And like, I couldn't, f I don't know what happened. Like the username disappeared. So I kept trying to log in and it was like, that account doesn't exist. So I never was able to get back into it. So that was just gone. Damn. Yeah, all my progress. Duolingo bird, if you're watching this. Duolingo owl, does he have a name? Duo? Duo, I think his name's Duo. Duo? Or LHM, help a girl out. Can you break my street? <laughs> so Julio Palmas of Argentina is known for furthering the advances in angio angioplasty surgery. Angioplasty? Angioplasty. An operation that helps unclog blood arteries and make it easier for blood to flow to the heart. Oh my god, this guy invented the balloon thing. Have you oh seen yeah, that balloon thing? the balloon thing. Shout out Argentina whenever you're getting a little, your artery declogged. Saving lives. Think about it. A lot of sciencey things. Yeah, look at us. Scientists. <gasps> Okay, my ladies, we're gonna love this. The contraceptive pill. Really? Woo! A chemist in Mexico, Luis Miramontes, was only 26. Okay, I'm 26. <laughs> I'm not inventing things out here like that. That's so crazy. Anytime someone receives like an accomplishment or achieves something at my age, I'm like, you're like, cool, 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 cool. cool. What do you mean? <laughs> That's so scary. Um, he derived it from a molecule from a wild Mexican yam known as a tortoise plant. So a Mexican man used a Mexican yeah. thing to make the pill. Oh, I thought you were gonna do a Dr. Seuss thing and be like, a Mexican man used a Mexican yam. <laughs> oh shit, I should have. Main ingredient in the birth control pill, nor norethindrone, is from a tortoise plant. A tortoise yam plant? Yeah. That's why in Sex of the City, she's eating a bunch of yams when she's on menopause. Oh, but then, a U.S. Food and Drug Administration developed it first, but he invented it. How dare you take it during LHM? How dare you? That's not surprising at all. Hercules Florence, a French-Brazilian inventor, is considered one of the pioneers of photography, developing a photograph some three years before Louis Daguerre. <laughs> I don't think I said that right, but... <laughs> Sounded fun, though. Okay, the rifle. Come on. We Why invented we guns? It was invented by a, an officer in the Mexican army who designed a gun capable of reloading a new bullet. So you're telling me that the people in this country that want to keep their guns want to kick out the people that kind of invented the gun? Typical! God damn Typical. it. Typical. So he invented the gun that you didn't have to do the whole, like, flip it first, over, put the stick in, shove the gunpowder in. He invented the one that you could just put a bullet and in And that's why we won the war. I'm just kidding. <laughs> well, the Europeans are wasting their time putting the, oh, the wait. stick in. It was used during World War One and in the Mexican Revolution. That's why we won, bitch. That's Viva why we Mexico. Won. 
I'm still obsessed with the captcha thing. I think that's hilarious. And that it relates back to Duolingo. Because <laughs> it's all connected. It's a conspiracy. Because now every time I'm mad when I'm like, why do you have to know if I'm a robot? Blame. You'll be like, it's okay. It's okay. I'm it's also, from Guatemala. It's, it's from okay. Guatemala. It's okay. I can't be mad at it anymore. <laughs>